Shakespeare Shorts programme is a really interesting idea because in a way it demonstrates how relevant and how robust Shakespeare and his work is. And Tori got in touch with regards to making a film for the British Council Shakespeare Lives series. The one that she, I think she felt most that she could relate to was A Midsummer Night's Dream and I think she found Titania's character to be the most interesting for her. We've got very used to seeing innovative, modern dress productions of Shakespeare in the theatre. But I think what's been interesting with this is to approach filmmakers, artists, writers, and to discuss with them Shakespeare plays and to say, what is it that inspires you? For example, with Midsummer Night's Dream, it's the idea of mistaken identities, of falling in love with the wrong person, deluding other people and deluding yourself. There's a really easy link, an allegory, between what happened in the Summer Night's Dream with a modern tale of it. And I found that link with the idea of coming infatuated or falling in love with the idea of someone else online uh, and not knowing you know, their true identity. The more we talked, the more I started to lean towards the idea of pushing it even further and allowing Bottom to not be someone else, but the idea of yourself as well, so you, the idea of how you present yourself online um, and the infatuation with that. So I've been brought into the project to play the part bottom um, and pretty much it's when Victoria travels through to this other realm and I'm kind of like this hyper reality version of her stuff. Give me some flight. The idea for the dance, I wanted it to be like a, a courting ritual, two birds of paradise. Um, I love the like the animalistic movements, the, the staccato sort of steps, the, the flurry, the showmanship. If you want to do an adaptation of Shakespeare and you want to do it for a modern audience, you have to make it relevant. The story was topical, it was current, uh, challenging, progressive, 